you've been through Why you got scars Since you walked through the door I've been trying to reach you Cause I feel you What's the story to tell? What's the story behind? The mountain you're trying to climb Think of her What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, or if you are brand new here and this is the very first time you ever see me, what's up? I am Jen, I share all things health and wellness here on the channel. Anything I do to level up my own life, I share with you guys in hopes to inspire and motivate you to do the same. So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video. All right beauties, we have another weekly grocery haul and meal plan video coming at you. Where'd we hit up this week? We did Whole Foods, which we haven't been in there in a hot minute. We did Aldi and we did Target, and I think that's it. We're gonna hit up Sam's and Walmart and probably have to do a pretty big haul next week week but we didn't need a ton of stuff this week hubby was out of town this week and my daughter works a ton and doesn't eat dinners home with us so just keeping it super simple and basic for me and little guy through the week and getting the bare minimum at the store which is no surprise to you guys because simple and basic when it comes to food is like the name of the game for me so you know we just get the basics to keep us trucking along keep us thriving on our health journey and in life in general but I also before we jump into the video I wanted to let you guys know that I will be going live here on YouTube on Sunday at 3 30 p.m. Eastern. I will post the thumbnail in the community tab as a reminder also and I'll remind you again at the end of this video but I want you guys to come hang out, chat, ask questions, anything. Go over the four-week challenge that I'm going to be doing in March. It's going to be awesome. It's only going to be $9.99 and it's not like a transformation or anything like that. You have a chance to win some awesome goodies at the end. It's going to be really fun so come hang out on the live, ask questions, find out about it. Join us. It's starting March 4th like I said for four weeks and it's only $9.99 for the month in my new app. So it's going to be super awesome. We're going to have a bunch of ladies in there all just ticking away at the habits that help us to stay healthy and keep us thriving and moving towards our goals. So if that sounds like an awesome time to you, then make sure to come join us. But without a ton of gabbing, let's go ahead and jump into the video. We're clocking in at 87 bucks at Aldi, but I feel like we got quite a bit of stuff for that this week. So we got a cantaloupe, a ton of fresh produce. We got a little baby watermelon, that's so cute. And a little baby, I don't know if it's coming up on camera how tiny it is, a little baby spaghetti squash. Of course, some of the mini cucumbers, which are my favorite. Got some zucchini. They didn't have any of the yellow squash, which I like to get those together and saute them together because they're delicious, but I will pick up yellow squash somewhere else to have that on the meal plan this week. Of course, some of the autumn crisp green seedless grapes, which are our favorite. And then we stocked up on all the bagels. We got cinnamon raisin bagels. We got everything bagels and we got some plain bagels. Of course, blueberries. We still have some blueberries in the fridge, so I only picked up one this week, but probably should have went ahead and just got two because we go through these like crazy. Pick some of this up, I believe last week or the week before, this drizzled granola bites. Pecan, pecan, however you say it, gluten-free. They are absolutely delicious. They almost taste like iced oatmeal cookies to me for some reason. A third cup is 150 calories, three grams protein. And we also got the blueberry lemon, I think is what they were, and that was really good too, but these ones were way better. Got some tortilla chips for Taco Tuesday some bananas, and then I saw some of these crunchy rice rolls and it caught my eye because it seems like something that my daughter would love. She likes to make like different like sushi rolls, sushi bowls, all that kind of stuff. They're 38 calories a serving and one gram protein. I have really no idea anything about them, but I'll keep you posted if she likes them. If you guys have tried them and loved them and how you use them, let me know down below. We got some organic extra bold coffee. Of course, stocked up on our sweet and spicy chunk light tuna, because you guys know that. I had this for lunch like every day last week and ran through the stock that we had, and I love to have this on hand because it's just a quick, easy option that's low calorie and high protein. We got some Honey Gold Organic Bite Sized Potatoes. I got some Wild Caught Pacific Cod. I got two packs of this for lunch this week and some strawberries that look decent, not the best, but they look okay. Then we also, of course, got some of the Mediterranean Herb Atlantic Salmon. Got a bunch of these little pouches for when my grandson comes over. He absolutely loves these and they had a ton of different flavors. So I stocked up on those and then got some ramen noodle for request of the little dude. That's everything from Aldi. Let's jump into Target. Clocking in at 90 bucks for Target, which you're probably thinking like 90 bucks for what? But I got some stuff over here that is not food related that was the majority of that price. But we got a couple dozen of the cage-free eggs. We got some of our favorite 
Good and Gather All Natural Turkey Sausage. You guys know I absolutely love this for meal prep and the macros are dynamite, 90 calories a serving, 11 grams protein, minimal good ingredients. These are new. I got some Wyman's Just Fruit and Greek Yogurt Bites. This is fruit and banana bites. Simple real ingredients, just grab and eat, 40 calories a cup. It says to keep them frozen. I don't know, I'll keep you guys posted on how I like these, but they look delicious. Then we got some Cascadian Farm Cinnamon Crunch Cereal for the little dude. Then we stocked up on all of the Good and Gather organic oatmeal we got some apple cinnamon we got some plain and we got some maple brown sugar these are awesome for pre-run fuel throw some protein powder in there to up the protein game and you're ready to rock and roll little guy loves these too so it works out great for all of us picked up this little eight pack of these breakfast cereal pouches it has lucky charms cheerios cinnamon toast crunch and honey nut cheerios i'm not the biggest fan of all of these cereals but little dude wanted some and it comes in these little single serving packs so i think that'll be perfect for him and then for some non-food items we got some pads and I picked up a couple things for my son's teacher. She's getting ready to have a baby. She's going on maternity leave on Friday. So I picked up this Frida Baby Basics Kit that has all these goodies in it and a gift bag from Target. And then I also got a couple things from Amazon to stick in there. These muslin swaddle blankets are so stinking soft. So we got two of those and then a cute little onesie that says my parents think that they are in charge. That's so cute, right? Because babies run the show. But she's leaving for maternity leave on Friday. So we wanted to get some goodies together to send in to her and the little one. All right, guys, we ended up spending a whopping 33 bucks at Whole Foods. Didn't get a ton of stuff. The main thing I ran in there for were some Zevias because I ran out and I didn't want to wait for any to come from Amazon. But I'm super glad that I did because I got a couple flavors that I don't get often or that I have never had like this one is raspberry lime. I've already drank one of these and OMG, they are absolutely delicious. Love it. Then I got some strawberry kiwi, mango ginger, watermelon, which is one of my favorites, and the pineapple paradise, which is also one of my favorites. They're all my favorite. I love them. They're all delicious. So we stocked up on a bunch of those. And then I went ahead and grabbed some of these love corn snacks. These are delicious. I got the sea salt and the salt and vinegar, which I haven't tried these flavors, but I've tried the original. If you guys remember the last time I went into Whole Foods, I got some of the original and they were super good. Everybody loved them, but I wanted to try a couple of the flavors. So I'll keep you guys posted on them. 120 calories for one serving, two grams protein, and the salt and vinegar is also 120 calories, two grams protein. And then random, I just got some Kerrygold butter because I needed some butter while I was in there, so I just went ahead and grabbed it. So that's a few goodies from Whole Foods. I didn't have a ton of time while I was in there to like really look around. I wanted to look for some other stuff, but I was in a hurry and had to run out, so we grabbed the goods and went. And then these I am super excited to try. I did not buy these. Actually, my girl Tina, one of my friends and clients, sent me these babies. I'm not sure where she gets these. I forget where she said. I have never seen them around here, but then again, I also don't go into stores very often. But these are the Genius Gourmet Crispy Protein Treats. They're salted caramel and vanilla. 110 calories, 10 grams protein, and the vanilla is 100 calories and 10 grams protein. She absolutely raves about these and says they are delicious. I'll keep you guys posted, or if you have tried them, let me know down below. And here's what we're working with for this week's meal plan. Monday, we'll be going in with Shrimp Fiesta Bowls, because they were so delicious. Tuesday, we will be making nachos. Wednesday will be leftovers. Thursday will be barbecue chicken tenders. We're just going to be using the chicken tenders that we have a ton of from Sam's. The Just Bear ones that are delicious and have awesome macros. And we'll be using some of that Kinder's barbecue sauce that we got also from Sam's. Super delicious. Friday, we'll be going in with smoked brisket and sweet potato. And that smoked brisket is from the Just Meats. Making everything super easy this week. Saturday, will be easy peasy fish and chips. And then Sunday, we'll be having dinner out. We'll be running 15 miles on Sunday. And then when we get back, I'll be filming a meal prep video. So the last thing I'm going to want to do is then also cook dinner. So we're just going to go out to eat that night and call it a wrap. So... That's all the goods on the dinner menu for this week. Let me know what you guys are eating, what you guys are loving. Drop it down below. Also on Sunday, I will be going live here on YouTube at 3.30 p.m. Eastern. If you guys can come hang out with me, come hang out and chat. I'm going to be going over a super fun four-week challenge that I'll be doing in March in my app, and I am super excited about that. So if you guys can come hang out, come hang out 3.30 p.m. Eastern. I will also post the thumbnail in the community tab to remind you guys. So I'd love to have you come ask questions, come hang out, come chat, all the things. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Share it with anybody else you think it may be helpful to. I appreciate you guys so very much. Subscribe before you leave so you don't miss out on any of the videos I post here on the channel. I hope y'all are having an absolutely killer day and I'll catch y'all in the next one.